All right, welcome back. Now we are checking in with Nicole DeCasto, who is with Aaron Holcomb, Director of Staff Ministries at Portland Rescue Mission. They're at uh, their Shepherd's Door location in Southeast Portland and discussing how going without a home can impact women and children. Nicole, tell us some more. Yes, we've moved over to a living room situation. This is a fantastic spot here. Portland Rescue Mission. We're out in Southeast Portland at their Shepherd's Door location. So excited. I just met Erin Holcomb and she is the director of staff ministries out here. And there's so much that you guys do to help women and children, especially in this location. So I wanted to break that down for people that when we talk about homelessness and this need, women and children come into play so often. That's right. And, and when you think of someone who's experiencing homelessness, most people don't think think of a mom with kids or a woman on their own. That's not the picture that pops into our mind. And yet right. what we know from recent surveys is that about 40% of the folks on the street are women or women with, with children. But we don't see them because safety is such a huge issue mm -hmm. when you're a woman alone on the streets. And so they're hiding. They might be in a car. They might be living with an unsafe person temporarily. They might be in a garage or a storage unit, mm -hmm. but they're concerned for their safety. So when we get women here at Shepherd's Door, mm -hmm. that is the first need we're looking to address, really a safe, beautiful place where they know that they and their children are are going to be safe, that they're going to be protected. Mm -hmm. And once they come here, they can let their guard down mm -hmm. and we can start doing the deeper work, the things around real healing. So we provide yes. a very supportive community, other women who are at different stages of the journey who can look back and say, I was where you were mm -hmm. and look where I'm at now. Mm -hmm. Women who come back and give their testimonies of leaving this, this place and going out and getting a job, keeping a job, getting their kids back. It just is an amazing supportive place for them. We also do, uh, you know, real deep addictions recovery work because for so many of the, these women, that is the obstacle that keeps putting them back on the streets. So helping them heal long-term from that, as well as job training, where they can get the skills they need to support themselves if they have children to support their children so they stay off the streets for the long term. And then just that individual counseling, spiritual care, really building into them the resources so that as they leave this place, they have a network of support and, and it really a transformed way to re-enter life. And we see that make a huge difference. Wow, you guys must see so much each week and it must be so rewarding. Yeah, it's, I mean, we have an incredible staff who really give their lives because they care about the women that come through these doors. We also see really cool stories. So one of the things we see a lot is women who have had their children removed for various issues who are reunited while they're here at Shepherd's Door. Mm -hmm. And you can imagine, you know, knowing how important family is, yes. we literally see families rebuilt through that process. So a mom who may have had her kids gone for a year or two, who her focus is, I want to get my kids back. What do I need to do to be stable and get them back? Mm -hmm. And we work with her. We have staff who specialize in walking with her through that process. And the days that those kids come back are very memorable days. And then oh. they get incorporated into this community too. And we see that generational change happen. It, because it goes from being you know, an issue of, of one generation to now her kids stay off the street. Now they know how to live a healthy and productive life. Now they have a, a supportive community who loves and invests in them. And it changes a whole generation. So we're really proud of the work we do here and we see lives change every single day. Every single day and that sense of community because someone might be coming in today, someone's been here a month yes. and they're all helping each other and it's just really beautiful to see. So Absolutely. the work you do is so important for our community but we need your help today of course. 1-877-544-1319. Give us a call today, portlandrescuemission.org as well. Let's provide the shelter, the meals and the care that lead to hope right here at Shepherd's Door. You guys are making it happen every day and we can't wait to help more women and children. We cannot wait to work with you as we help change lives. Thanks so much for sharing your stories today. Thank you, my pleasure. That's right, we are changing lives. Thanks, Nicole and Aaron. Aaron visit PortlandRescueMission.org to learn more and make your uh, gift, give your gift today for their Hope 24-7 telethon. We'll be right back.